peace became a distant memory. It is now the year 2077. We stand on the brink of total war. And I am afraid. For myself. For my wife. For my infant son. Because if my time in the army taught me one thing, It's that war, war never changes. War never changes. You're gonna knock him dead at the Veterans Hall tonight, hon. You think? Absolutely. Now get ready and stop hogging the mirror. Right. Nice haircut. What do you think, hon? Beard or no beard? Wait, did you get a haircut yesterday? Hey, my turn, big guy. Let me just slide in here.
sir. Your coffee. 173.5 degree Fahrenheit. Thanks, Kazuwa. Of course, sir. Grognak the Barbarian in the Jungle of the Bat Babies. My favorite. Hey, hon. Nervous? Don't be. Everyone's gonna love the speech. Sugar bombs. 100% daily value of sugar. He comes for you every day. Good morning! Voltec calling! Voltec? Remind me again? Why, we're about you, sir, and helping secure your future. You see, Voltec is the foremost builder of state of the art underground fallout shelters. Vaults, if you will. Luxury accommodations where you can wait out the horrors of nuclear devastation. You can't begin to know how happy I am to finally speak with you. I've been trying for days. It's a matter of utmost urgency, I assure you. What's so important? Why, nothing less than your entire future. If you haven't noticed, sir, this country has gone to heck in a handbasket. If you'll excuse my language, the big kaboom is... It's inevitable, I'm afraid, and coming sooner than you may think, if you catch my meaning. Now, I know you're a busy fellow, so I won't take up much of your time. Time being a, uh, a precious commodity. I'm here today to tell you that because of your family service to our country, you have been pre-selected for entry local vault. Vault 111. But there's room for my entire family, right? Of course, of course. Minus your robot, naturally. In fact, you're already cleared for entrance. It's just a matter of verifying some information. Don't want there to be any holdups in the unforeseen event of <laughs> total atomic annihilation. <laughs> Won't take but a moment. Tell me more about this vault. Oh, it has all the amenities of the modern home, I assure you. Not to mention total protection from nuclear radiation and hostile mutants. A better future underground. It's not only our mission, it's our passion. Sure, let's do it. Splendid! Splendid. Now, uh, <clears throat> let's see.
Wonderful. That's everything. Uh, just gonna walk this over to the vault. Congratulations on being prepared for the future. Um, thanks again. Hey. Hey, hon. For you and Sean, no price is too high. <laughs> Good answer. I have my moments. Mr. Max, Sean has been changed, but he absolutely refuses to calm down. I think he needs some of that paternal effect. Hey, Codsworth. Mr. Max, you heard Codsworth. Come on. Sean requires your personal attention. A boy needs his father, after all. How are the two most important men in my life doing? Spin the mobile a bit. He loves that. Hey, how's my little guy? Much better now, huh? Listen, after breakfast, I was thinking we could head to the park for a bit. Weather should hold up. Yeah, sounds like fun. Sir? Mom? You should come and see this! Codsworth? What's wrong? Followed by... Yes, followed by flashes, blinding flashes. Sounds of explosions. We're, uh, trying to get confirmation. Codsworth. What? We seem to have lost contact with our affiliate stations. We do, oh, we no. do have, we do have coming in. That's, um, confirmed reports, I repeat, confirmed reports of nuclear detonations in New York and Pennsylvania. My God. Oh my God. We, we need to get to the vault. Now! I've got Sean. Let's go. Residents of Sanctuary Hills, if you are registered, evacuate to Vault 111 immediately. Vault participants, head this way. We're on the list. We're gonna die! Infant, adult male, adult female. Okay, go ahead. Thank you. You two, follow me. Come on! What's gonna happen to all those people outside We're the doing gate? We're everything we can. This now way. keep moving. Step keep going. On the this way. In the center. Almost there. We're gonna be okay. I love you. Both of you. We love you too. Oh my god! Hold on! Everyone, please step off the elevator and proceed up the stairs in an orderly fashion. No need to worry, folks. This is our new. Get home. everyone situated in your new home. Vault 111. A better future underground. So we just. Yes, off the stairs. I can't believe it. If we left a minute later. Hey, huh? No, we no. don't be. It's don't gonna be okay, right? About that. You're safe now. Everyone, just head up these stairs and through the door there. Hey there. That elevator. So slow. Oh. is here for you. Oh, we made it. Please proceed this way, in please. an orderly this way, good. Step Mail. over to the table. Mail. Just this way. Female and Welcome. Pick up a suit. You'll right need your there. suits before we can right take over you there. further. Just step over to the table. Over there. Take a seat. Uh, 
Thanks. What now? Just follow the doctor here. He'll show you where to go. All right. Excuse me. It's down follow the hallway me. right there. Excuse me. Just this here way. you are. See? Head down the hall there. This is our new home. Oh, you're gonna love it. This hey, is one of down that hallway. Facilities. They'll show you where to go. The others aren't great, mind you. Hey there. This way, please. It's gone. Our home. Everything Sir? we had. My mother and father down in DC. Oh, God. Uh, how what long do you think we'll be down here? I know this. Oh, we'll be going over all that in orientation. Just a few medical items we have to get through first. The vault suit is designed to be fashionable as well as comfortable. Prepared for the future, right? Hey there. Guess we're some of the lucky ones, right? Whew. Just excuse me. Take your time. We've got. and depressurize you before we head deeper in the vault. Just relax. Time for a whole new life. Resident secure. Occupant vitals normal. Procedure complete. In five. Why would Voltaire do this? Come on, come on, come on! Oh, God! I'll find who did this. And I'll get Sean back. I promise.
Hello? Anyone? Giant roaches? What the hell? Where is everyone? Is this all that's left? Nice. Coming back later for you. Thank you. 
find the terminal.
service, and thank you for choosing Vault Tech. As I live and breathe, oh, it's, it's really you. Codsworth. What happened to the world? The world, sir? Well, besides our geranium still being the envy of Sanctuary Hills, I'm afraid things have been dreadfully dull around here. Things will be so much more exciting with you and Mrs. Beck. Where is your better half, by the by? They... They killed her. Sir, these things you're saying, these, these terrible things, I, I believe you'll need a distraction. Yes, a distraction to calm this dire mood. It's been ages since we've had a proper family activity. Checkers, or perhaps charades. Sean does so love that game. <laughs> Is the lad uh, with you?
He's gone. God damn it. Someone took him. Someone stole my son. It's worse than I thought. <laughs> You're suffering from hunger-induced paranoia. Not eating properly for 200 years will do that, I'm afraid. <laughs> 200 years? What? Are you... A bit over 210, actually, sir. Or oh, give or take a little for the Earth's rotation and some minor dings to the old chronometer. <laughs> that means you're uh, two centuries late for dinner. <laughs> Perhaps I can whip you up a snack? <laughs> you must be famished. Codsworth, you're acting... a little bit weird. What's wrong? I... I... Oh, sir, it's been just horrible. Two centuries with no one to talk to, no one to serve. I spent the first ten years trying to keep the floors waxed, but nothing gets our nuclear fallout from vinyl wood. Oh, nothing. And don't get me started about the futility of dusting a collapsed house. And the car, the car, how do you polish rust? Whoa, whoa, focus, Codsworth. Uh, I'm afraid I don't know anything, sir. The bombs came and all of you left in such a hurry. I thought for certain you and your family were dead. I did find this hollow tape. I, I believe the missus was going to present it to you as a, as a surprise. But then, well, everything happened. A hollow tape? What's on it? I believe it's a private message for you. My etiquette protocols would not permit me to play it for myself. Any standard holotape reading device should be able to play it back. Oh, like that Pip-Boy on your arm. That should work brilliantly. Now, enough feeling sorry for myself. Shall we search the neighborhood together? The Mrs. and young Sean may turn up yet. All right. Lead the way. Proud to serve, sir! Godsworth. Mr. Matt, it's sex smashing time! Oh, God! He's got a smash! Well, you know. Yeah, but a few flies. Wait. My senses are picking up movement in another house. Follow me! Max, your, your family isn't here either. Sean's out there, Codsworth. I need to find him. What about Conquer, sir? Plenty of people there. And 
last I checked, they only pummeled me with sticks a few times before I had to run back home. There's still people alive in Concord? Yes, although they're a bit rough. Uh, you remember the way? Just across the southern footbridge out of the neighborhood and past the Red Rocket Station? I shall remain here and secure the home front.